What is up guys, it is Robert of Movies with me, and welcome to the Knives Out Movie Review. Just to let you know, no spoilers in this review at all. So, if you didn't know, this movie was directed by Ryan Johnson, and it stars Chris Evans, Daniel Craig, Anna DeArmas, a, a, a crazy cast, a really damn big cast, a lot of people. Christopher Plummer stars a very well-known writer that happens to die. And uh, there is an investigation on who done it and why did he die? And uh, and it's really damn good. The movie, honestly, it, it it was actually damn fantastic. Nowadays, there's not really a lot of mystery movies. I remember the last mystery movie that I feel like I saw that you would consider like a who done it is uh, Murder on the Orient Express, and I thought it was okay that movie. But this movie was damn good. Ryan Johnson's just an awesome director, and especially here. I love the fact that this house almost feels like a character within itself. Like, I, I love this house and the, the production design of it. So many damn good shots of just the interior of, of so many different rooms. And it just gives that vibe of, of just a very clue-like house. The cast. I mean, obviously, if you see this list of people, it's a lot of great names on there. And everyone does fantastic performances. There's really not one that's like, ooh, that doesn't really work. Every single one really puts their A game on, and it's just, it shows. It was nice seeing Ana de Armas actually get some real shine because uh, a big movie that I, I, I love her from is from Blade Runner 2049. Uh, I love that movie. It's one of my favorite movies. And uh, she's actually in a role that's more prominent. Uh, she's a lead, and uh, she does a great job. You know, it's funny seeing Chris Evans not being Captain America. I know he starred in other things uh, prior to Captain America and during Ca Captain America. But it is just interesting him basically being the twist of what he ne usually normally never is. And I quite like it. You know, a lot of these people I feel like go against what they usually play in a character. And I quite like that because it gives them time to show their range. And I think it's damn fantastic. Again, the performance is all A. Daniel Craig as this detective is just great, you know. Hearing him talk, like, oh, well, that was a really bad way. I don't know, how does he talk? He, he, he talks in an accent, and it's pretty damn good. And it, it's just entertaining seeing him be this detective who uh, you kind of feel like really isn't the greatest, but uh, he's really good. And, and he does it such a great job at, at, at show, showcasing this type of detective and how he is. The actual movie itself is, it can be pretty funny at times. I've seen people say it's hilarious, but I don't think it's necessarily hilarious, but it's, it's pretty funny. It's got its moments of humor and it's got its moments of tension. There's actually certain scenes with tension and that really damn works. They were able to juggle a few tones throughout the movie without it feeling bad. And, and that's quite a good feat because not a lot of movies could do that. A lot of times people uh, have a hard time balancing humor with, with thrills and, and drama, but uh, Ryan Johnson did a great job actually keeping this nice and tight, and it was fantastic. He also wrote the script, I believe, so it, it's pretty crazy. He did a great job in this movie, but it's a lot of fun. The movie it takes a lot of twists and turns that you don't quite see, and uh, even me, you know, I don't like to guess things throughout a movie, but even I was thinking where it would go, and, and I personally didn't guess it, and maybe you do. Maybe you think it's obvious and the plot that's going to be going on but i thought it was pretty well done i'm not a fan of movies explaining how something happened you know i don't love that and and that movie does this and you know you get it kind of has to because it is a mystery after all and it is going to showcase stuff that you don't know but i just don't love that idea and i just wish there was maybe another way that that people could kind of do something like that but it does it and it's still entertaining but i just i don't love that type of style the turns that the movie tries to take doesn't necessarily blow my mind but it is entertaining and i still in the end of the day thought it was a fantastic movie i thought he did a great job everyone did a great job from the production design to the performances to the cinematography everyone does a really damn good job and yeah overall i'm gonna give knives out a nine out of ten I thought it was fantastic, for real. I thought it was genuinely really good. It's one of my favorite. It's like my top, one of my top ten favorite movies of the year so far. Uh, I don't know exactly where I place it, but it was. It's fucking great. Like I'm not. It's it's fucking great, and you're gonna have a lot of fun with it. Again, the, the especially this cast just oozes charisma, and you gotta love it for that alone. Even 
I think it's great. I think it's great. I definitely, think, I would definitely recommend checking it out. I think Ryan Johnson's awesome, man. I love Star Wars: The Last Jedi. I know people don't love that, but I think he, regardless, does really good and uh, knives out. And I think people are really gonna enjoy it. It's it's a fucking great whodunit. Especially, I don't remember the last time I saw a whodunit like this. To be honest, the, again, I keep bringing up Murder in the Orient Express, and I thought that was just okay. So yeah, guys. That was my Knives Out review. Did you like Knives Out? Did you like it? Let me know down in the comments below, and I'll uh, uh, I'll reply. <laughs> so yeah, guys. See you guys next time. If you didn't know I make music, always in the link below. Also, you can check out my gaming channel where I have a video series called Back of the Backlog, a movie TV show-like gaming series. So uh, <laughs> check that out. And uh, so yeah, guys. That'll be it for today. And I'll see you guys next time. Knives Out. It was damn good, dude. Definitely recommend it. Definitely recommend it. Especially now. There's not a lot uh, out that I'd say is that amazing. So yeah, this is easily the best movie out right now. So definitely go check it out. Definitely support it. So yeah, guys. Like the chick that was made in 96. I'll make myself sleep the progress. We need sleep with it. Trying to achieve in life. You could meet me by the London. Cause I don't got the money to fund it. I'm less cold when I throw the cost of one word to make it work. But now I'll just write this verse. Play dead seeds in the dirt. This is the fight of my life, pulling out punchlines It's always crunch time, I can be just fine